Hello Virgo, this is your daily for the 9th through the 10th. This is for Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. If you guys are new to the channel, welcome. Please hit the like button, share the video, subscribe to the channel. We're going to go ahead and pull a Romance Angels card for you. Not Romance Angels, my goodness. Um, an Angel Prayers card, okay? Let's see. Earth Angel. Huh. Thank you, angels, for inspiring me to be more like you. Hmm. I like it. Let's see what's going on. This is your thing for today, okay? Let's see what's going on with my Virgo friends. Hmm. Ace of Swords, the Moon, and the Two of Wands. Hmm. I feel like this is you guys doing what is right for you, doing what is right for others as well, um, without actually receiving anything in return is what I'm getting here. Because this is this is you doing what's right, regardless of what you actually um, know about something or someone. This is also being truthful, being honest, not being secretive. Okay, and choosing that path. Um, usually. You know, we only want to involve ourselves in things when we can know the full truth about something because that's where we're comfortable at. And that is a very earth earthy energy. My moon is in Capricorn, so you know, I I really vibe with that. And um, I like to know what I'm getting into before I actually, you know, go in that direction. And I feel like this is a this is an this is you guys not really having to to have something steadfast that you can see or put your hand on or your finger on um but still deciding to go or move in a direction um you know that you want to move without having all of the all of the things laid out for you, you know, like one, two, three, or, you know, black and white. This is being able to discern, use your discernment um, without anybody else's input to determine where you are going. And I feel like you guys are at a crossroads right now because something is very unclear to you like it's not solid you don't have the facts about it you have a feeling about it you have a feeling about it but you're just not sure of it and so you know you're at a crossroads a lot of you here and let's see why this is let's see hmm There's something that, you know, that, hmm, there's a relationship here and it does not have to be an intimate relationship, but there's something that you learned. You may not have all of the facts, but there's something that you learned that is very important, okay? Something that you know deep down inside of yourself. You have some of the connecting dots. You just don't have all of them. But you have enough to, to know what to do from here. Okay? There was something that, that you ended or somebody else ended here. That I think you're not really sure why it ended. And you're really wanting to know the, you know, the full story about what happened here, what really happened here, okay? But 
you can only this nine of swords is is um an overactive imagination and this what this is saying is that nine times out of ten whatever it is that you are thinking to whatever extent you're thinking whatever magnitude you feel like it's on it's really not to that extent one way or the other it's not as bad as what you think it is here this is what the nine of swords is saying okay and i feel like a lot of you are you know you're wanting to move you're wanting to move on um a lot of you are fathers um mothers somebody that was in a very committed relationship maybe a marriage and you're usually you're you're this very um very controlled very uh supportive individual and you're having a hard time leaving this behind because you're somebody that also likes to know what you're actually getting into it into before you actually do it here I think a lot of you maybe left somebody behind, maybe an air sign, um, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, um, or maybe a Scorpio or Cancer, Pisces individual, and um, could very well be a fire sign as well, Aries, Leo, Sag. I mean, it could be any sign, but I think you guys are not really sure about where you go from here. I think part of you wants to still be there for somebody and then part of you wants to leave okay it's like this pull between you here with the two of wands okay let's see what's going on what's influencing this situation outside influence please hmm some of you are feeling left out in the cold some of you are feeling that you left somebody out in the cold. Some of you feel like you turned your back on an individual. And others of you feel like this individual turned their back on you. So the energy can go vice versa, guys, okay? But I feel like the Page of Swords doesn't speak. But I feel like somebody wants to address this issue of you guys not being there for each other through thick and thin because a king of uh, pentacles is somebody that is there through thick and thin so somebody's really kind of rethinking the situation um not sure about you know whether or not to address someone i feel whether or not to speak to someone someone that you feel like maybe um you know is upset or that maybe you did wrong or somebody did you wrong is the way you're feeling and you're not really knowing why okay so let's see what the advice is here oh a lot of cards i want one please one card for advice three of wands um what this is saying to me is that you know I feel like you shouldn't be conflicted about this situation because whatever you feel like you should do, then that's what you should do it. That's what you should do. I'm sorry. That's what you should do. If you feel like you want to go towards your horizon, which is another individual, then that's what you should do do what you feel will make you happy okay do what you feel see those two of wands right there right you're no longer looking at the two of wands deciding which way to go you have one wand in your hand this is being sure of what it is that you want to do because deep down inside you know it okay Again, if this is for a cross watcher, if that is you, um, that can go your way as well. All right, guys. So that is what I have for you. And I will be speaking with you guys soon. Bye now.